After Apple patched and blocked iOS 13.5 jailbreak, Uncover team is back with a new release that can jailbreak iOS 13.5.5 beta 1 on all iPhone and iPad devices. If you missed jailbreaking on 13.5, now you have another chance to jailbreak by upgrading or downgrading to 13.5.5 beta 1 firmware. To begin, Download iOS 13.5.5 Beta 1 IPSW from links in description below and use iTunes or Finder on your computer to restore your device. Once the restore is complete, simply set up your iPhone the usual way. This may or may not involve activation of the device itself. As you can see here, your iPhone is now successfully restored on iOS 13.5.5 ready to be jailbroken using the latest version of Uncover. Once the restore process is complete, while the phone is still connected to your computer, head over to allstore.io in your web browser and then download it on your computer. Once downloaded, install it the usual way. This involves installation of mail plugin, which you can do so as shown in the video steps here. Once the mail plugin is successfully installed, it's time to install Arl Store on the device itself. To do this, click on Arl Store in the menu bar and then click on Install Arl Store followed by the name of your iPhone. When prompted, enter your Apple ID credentials and wait for it to be sideloaded on the device. Once the app is side loaded, first head to settings, general, device management and trust the profile. Next, open Safari browser and download the latest version of Uncover jailbreak app.
Once the latest version of Uncover is downloaded, open it in our store app. In our store app, it will ask you for your Apple ID credentials again. Enter them and wait for it to sign the Uncover app. The Uncover app is installed and signed by the Alt Store. Launch it and then hit the blue jailbreak button to begin jailbreaking process. While this method requires your device to be connected to your computer, soon we will have a version of this jailbreak which can jailbreak iOS 13.5.5 uh, without any requiring any computer so uh, make sure you stay tuned for that video uh, because we'll have a tutorial on it that on that version as well On second reboot, you should now have Cydia on the home screen. As you can see, it's Cydia running on iOS 13.5.5 Beta 1. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon to receive notifications about future videos from this channel. See you in the next video.